What's going on guys? It's your boy Darwin here today. It's the day after my leg day video. Missed a few exercises after I posted that. So we're gonna get some of those in today and I'm gonna go ahead and do some back today. So I'll see you guys soon. All right, we got this incline leg press. I like to hit these, really target the quads and the hamstrings. I really like to focus at the bottom and explode at the top. Really getting a wide stance to get the inside of the leg. This was a little tough for me today, having did legs the day before, but I had to get this in because I didn't hit it the day before and you really want to focus on getting those legs nice and strong legs should be the strongest part of the body for sure not gonna lie my legs feeling pretty dead from yesterday but now we're going into calf raises these are one of my favorite exercises in the gym calves is a must in the gym i don't care what anyone says oh don't hate calves calves don't grow i don't know what you will are taking but hit your calves you can see here these not a lot of people hit these i always get questions when i hit these in the gym these are anterior tibialis raises so it's almost like a reverse calf raise but this is for the shins really targets the shin strengthens the overall lower part of the knee really nice to add in all right now we're doing some leg press wide stance to really target the inner portion of the quad I like to really pump these out but in a range that still has constant tension all right so now I'm hitting the one leg leg press had a stress fracture a while back so my right foot is a little bit smaller than my left so I'm hitting these isolated leg press just to get some of that strength back these are really good to do in general but these are just to get that overall development back so the legs are more symmetrical alright now here we're going into back I like to hit these these are rows but you can see the positioning that I'm in really gets an emphasis on the stretch of the lat you want to pull that in keeping your elbows tucked pulling with the elbows pulling with the elbows making sure to squeeze the lat as you pull the weight in getting that full range of motion these are really good for anyone struggling with lat activation all right now we got the high row these are really nice too you want to squeeze the lat activating it you can kind of see that in the video here I'm squeezing before I pull with the elbows that way I'm getting full lat activation which is the key it's not always about the weight weight is important but muscle activation is king you can make a lot of gains with medium to light weight as long as you're getting the activation of the muscle
wrap up. My leg and back day is very tired, so I wrapped up with this, which is the rear delt machine. Rear delts are key for overall development of the back and shoulders. Gives you that wide look. So I'm hitting these. This is something that I've just added into my regimen, but it's really good. But after this, man, I was done. There are so many things in life that will cause you to lose focus if you focus on those things. So with that in mind, really focus on what's important. 